Welcome back to the shop. I'm going to show you two simple modifications you can do to your floor jack to make it much more versatile. I have two Harbor Freight jacks here. This is a three ton steel jack and this is a one and a half ton aluminum jack. Both jacks have removable contact pads as you can see here. This opens up a whole bunch of options for you. You now have a mounting hole that you can add something to. The quick little modification I did for myself, I took a hockey puck, I put a spud on it that fits in that hole. Bam, now I have a protected soft pad for under a car that has a polished uh, frame or painted frame or chrome parts. Uh, made one for the aluminum jack too. Just took a hockey puck. Guys, there's, there's a thousand uses for hockey pucks. I use them as leveling pads, all kinds of stuff. Vibration, absorption pads, right there, bam. Now you have protection here. It can't slide off. So instead of just putting the pad there and throwing a puck on top here, that could slide off. That's a little dangerous. So by adding this uh, spud, it's screwed through the puck, as you can see here, into the spud. Bam. So here's another option, too. Uh, this is a pretty big mounting pad. That's registered in here real well. You can take a hockey puck, throw it in the center here. Um, it's in the cup, so it can't really go anywhere. That's another option. You can also make other kind of brackets that sit in here, but be careful not to do anything too wide because you could tip these jacks over, especially the more narrow ones. So anyway, I hope you found this useful. Um, I find it very useful because now I don't have to put a whole bunch of towels on these jacks when I'm jacking up the car or a freshly painted frame. So anyway, until next time, see ya.